Once again, President Donald Trump is getting out of Washington, this time for a 17-day vacation at a golf course he owns in New Jersey. Whether this will be his first vacation depends on how you define vacation. But regardless of your definition, Trump has managed to visit his clubs in Virginia, New Jersey, and Florida at least 41 times total, according to one online tracker. That comes out to Trump spending part or all of 21 of his first 28 weekends in office at Trump properties. If that sounds like a lot, that's because it is. By this point in his presidency in 2009, Barack Obama spent about 15 days away from the White House. By the end of his first year, he was at 26. During his first year, George W. Bush took nine vacation trips, totaling 69 days. By one estimate, Trump's weekend jaunts away from the White House have cost taxpayers about $55 million so far. In contrast, in all eight years in office, Obama spent about $97 million on those sorts of trips. That price tag covers costs like security and flying Air Force One. And notably, spending time away from the White House is something Trump often criticized Obama for on Twitter. 